All right, Coach, uh, second week back from the break, uh, starting up conference play again against a uh, preseason favorite Minnesota Duluth team who seems to do a lot of good things on the ice. Uh, your early thoughts on them this week? Well, I think uh, first and foremost, I think Duluth is as good a team as I've seen uh, all year long. Uh, there's a reason why they were picked to, to finish first in our conference. Um, we got a lot of guys back uh, from a team that uh, was pretty pretty good a year ago. Their goaltending solid. Um, defensemen uh, are real mobile and uh, you know can get the puck up the ice. And their forwards are deep and talented. And I think they've outshot every team in our in our uh, or the games that they've played. So um, we're gonna have to really be ready to go and and. Um, you know, it's it's January now, and it's in the meat of the season, and uh, every game uh, you got to play your best to give yourself an opportunity. Your team caught fire in the third period and on Sunday to get that win against RPI coming from behind. Uh, what things did you see out of that period that you think can really be a good uh, carryover into the weekend? Well, I, I, as I said Sunday after the game, I thought our third period was about as good as we've played in a long time. Uh, I thought everybody was on the same page doing the things that we asked them to do. And, um, you know, the, the energy, the, the executing of the game plan uh, was there f pretty much for the entire third period. And we didn't change the way we were playing uh, based on the score or, or things, that were, things that were happening to us. Uh, good or bad. So uh, a real good step forward. Um, we have to make sure that we bring that uh, type of mindset and mentality into not only into practice this week, but uh, into the game starting on Friday. So, um, you know, work in progress. And, uh, you know, like I said, a good step forward. But uh, we need to continue to work to get better. Facing a team that possesses the puck as much as Duluth does, how much more of a premium does that puck management game and making good decisions when you've got your opportunities well, uh, become? Yeah, uh, you're absolutely right. You got to make sure that you manage and uh, manage the puck well. You got to play well away from the puck. Uh, you've got to put yourself in situations where you're not, you know, you're not going to turn the puck over, and uh, you know, you got to cut your losses at times and live to play another day and uh, understand the uh, uh, the situation that you're in and, and you know, know where the danger's uh, coming from and things like that. So uh, all in all, I think, um, you know, I think our guys understand that. Um, you know, teams like Duluth and the teams that we're going to face the rest of the way uh, will force you to make uh, uh, some tough plays, but you're going to have to be ready to go and make strong plays uh, all over the ice team will have a little bit of a, a rost, sort of roster addition uh, coming into the week. Uh, I'm sure you've been following Louis' play over in Finland and uh, USA getting a medal. Uh, what were your thoughts as far as how he performed with a lot of minutes there? Well, I thought Louis played, for the most part, pretty, played pretty well. Um, you know, you never know coming, those guys coming back, especially a long flight from overseas. Um, you know, we'll see. We'll, we'll probably... You know, it'll be a game time decision with Louis. Um, you know, I don't think he gets in until real late um, Wednesday night. So um, we'll just have to see how it goes. He, there's a chance he will play. There's a chance he might not play um, this weekend. But uh, to go back to U.S. winning a bronze medal, that's that's huge for uh, for our country and obviously for the college hockey players that played on USA. So uh, real good showing for them, and and uh, we're proud of Louis and. And uh, we'll be glad to have him back. You mentioned how well the team played in that third period on, on Sunday. Was that one of your better up and down performances? You get three, uh, not excluding the empty net goal, uh, three goals from three different lines. Well, I, I just think we played a little bit more determined. Um, you know, we still made mistakes and, and we still didn't manage the puck as well as I, I think we want to. Um, but obviously you get contributions from everybody, and that's, that's a good sign. And um, like I said, I thought our third period, we didn't change the way we were playing based on the score. All right. Thank you, Coach. Okay, thank you.